call a medical intuitive. And I take a dive into health. And what that means for me is when I connect with you and your body, your body gives me information. Sometimes it can show me where pain is. It will give me the name of a particular disease or disharmony going on in the body. And so that's step number one is identifying where the discomfort is coming from. The second piece is actually how do we turn around and change that? And that one's a little more difficult. We may do things like a frequency wash where we're dealing with frequencies and sound waves, even though you can't hear them, it doesn't matter. Energy flows, and that's why playing it on mute doesn't matter because everything is energy, and energy moves whether you hear it or not. So I might do frequency work, I might break down molecules, like H2O, we can break those molecules apart to release them from the body. And we also release a lot of thoughts, feelings, and emotions, I call them TFEs, that have been trapped inside the cells of the body. That what they do is they actually create problems in that cell. They can deform them and create. All right then, so welcome to our junk consciousness, false light, junk consciousness, um, reveal medical intuitive Lynn Waldrop. I just want to call her Lynn Waldorf with her body channel and medical intuitive. And she just hasn't even started telling you all the things that she supposedly does with her work and her frequency checks. But uh, let's dive into this a little deeper. So uh, first of all, I need to say that um, well, I'll say this, she who has nothing to hide, hides nothing. So if the only some of it's going to be true, to be honest, and I'll own my stuff, um, I am a powerful healer and maybe Lynn is too. Uh, we'll see what the tech has to say. So, uh, let's go on. This is super non-hilarious, but, uh, I don't make videos very often. And when I make my videos, my dogs go absolutely haywire. I also want to say that um, this is my opinion. It's my opinion that I have a right under freedom of speech to express my opinion. I also know of her through um, Access Consciousness. I know of Lynn also from being on many, many, many telesummits for many years with her. Um, and this is also for entertainment. Air. So many people wrote me about her, but you especially... have to be buyer beware when you're dealing with telesummits. These people are snake oil and I think are super bad. Uh, some of the women, if your income is dependent on you pimping out healers, would you be, they'll be honest, would you be um, or sell healers that were real or that have been vetted or proven? Um, and of course, some of that's opinion, but not all and not very much. So of course you wouldn't, because these people live in 300, 400, 500 million dollar homes. The healers, some of the healers uh, live in million dollar homes and uh, they have a partnership with these Telesummit hosts to pimp them out. And it's all based on fear. They even teach you and, and the um, person that books for the Telesummit host even teaches you about fear-based selling. And they even, the order that they put them in, there's this big competition. They try to get you to be competitive with each other and sell the most packages for them. Pimping yourself out. Um, isn't it better to be in integrity? Do exactly what you feel led to do. Do uh, at this point in your life and not be pimped out. So there's nothing wrong with promotion. Um, I mean, I promote my control me. And generally I'm not directly selling a package, 897, 297. Um, package. And I'm going to be revealing more and more about the telesummit industry and my experience in it as we go along. And yes, I will uh, make it really clear who I'm talking about as well, about this woman and said, could you please, 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 uh, uh, you know, told me all these horrible things, which some of them I'll share. Some of them can't even be repeated. So uh, let's go ahead. So the complaints are ripoff. The tracks do nothing. Her sessions do nothing. She claims to heal me. Nothing has ever been healed. She's unkind. She's egotistical. She's rude. Of course, those are opinions, but these are clients who have paid money and they have a right to their opinion and they have a right to share their opinion and I have a right to share their opinion. 
Again, this is their opinion. We all have enemies. I certainly have my share. Um, we all hate her. She can be the best healer, the most accurate healer, uh, or whatever frequency person or sound healer, and you're going to have uh, soon too. But, but I do think possibly Lynn started off right when she went into access consciousness, but now she's totally immersed in working with extremely dishonest people. Um, that are pimping her out in the junk consciousness, false light industry, where money is king and deception wrong. So my personal challenge for all these junk consciousness, false light, telesummit uh, healers that have been around head to head with a stranger live and let the stranger client decide who's more accurate in our reading. No one has ever taken me up on this offer. Why? I'll take, I mean, I'll do it. If somebody wants me to come on their show that I maybe said some not so flattering things with the technology and realize when I say the technology says something about someone, it's not the technology. It's not my app. It's not me putting it on anything. You tell us everything and you are never wrong. I just have access to things you don't necessarily have visceral access to like your thoughts, your belief systems and your emotions. And I am a master programmer. So a lot of people sell these apps and there's a lot of brands of these apps. There's a lot of machines, but the difference between somebody who can really dig down and get the dirt is experience. So we have teachers and trainers out there that are like, I'm this and I'm that, and this is what you do. And they don't even know what they're talking about. They, they did within your being. But that's a whole nother video. All right. So this offer is extended to the person who stole mine. This show with your face, with your hair plugs, and let's go head to head. And you know who you are and you lied about me. I have emails to prove it. I have clients that are still my clients uh, that know your lies and know their lies and we can prove it all. Um, I can you, and I'm speaking to all healers, can and you, if you can't, and I'm speaking to the Tele Summit host to them, there is a cause and effect in this universe, even if karma is broken, and you will be held accountable for the liars and the slime and the MK Ultra uh, actors that you shoved down our throats. So let us formally access consciousness. What is access consciousness? A lot of you have heard of it and like, oh yeah, that's like a cult thing. It is kind of a cult thing. It's a hideous cult thing. Um, I did my own dance with them way back, way longer. Uh, I woke up, as pretty when they're telling you like to have open crazy sex and all sorts of things that it's a cult. But a division of Scientology, it's, it's called Scientology. It's the remake, one of the remake, 12 requests to do in because they are so angry they've been ripped off and received nothing of value. All right, so what does Lynn do? Is she practicing medicine? I would say yes. I would say Lynn is practicing medicine without a license. Uh, when the standard modern medicine, this is from her website, uh, information. It's funny because we send people to the doctor and lab tests all the time. We're like, you need to go get your hormones tested. You need to have your need to go to the doctor. You need to have blood tests. You need to have genetic testing. Lynn doesn't do that. Apparently, Lynn is, you know, your final stop. Are you looking for alternatives to drugs and testing? Maitland! Does that not sound like every used car salesman you've ever heard? Now, if you know personality, like look at this face, look at the personality of this face. It's hilarious. Look at the happiness and joy uh, coming off and glowing off this face. Yeah. And she's an active inflammation on a high level, not even minor active inflammation, even like um, it has nothing to do with weight either. People think inflammation has to do with weight. Well, it does, but it doesn't only, I have, you know, daughters under hundred pounds that can be an active inflammation. You can see it. So any um, oriental or classically trained naturopath or Chinese medicine practitioner would be able to say, yeah, Lynn's an active inflammation. Um, and, and what do you feel? Is this who you want to go to for your healers? It's the vibe that you want to receive. Look at her face. First pull aura tends to reflect accurately the average state of being in the person at least within months. Uh, and this is an angry person. Her R says she's angry. This is a weak, 
and by the way, this is a current poll, uh, and it doesn't matter if it's an old picture because uh, the uh, template is the whole, and that's a whole nother book and video. But this is a weak low level frequency person. Uh, she's somewhat expanded, but what is she expanded into? Expanded into anger, in expanded into anxiety, uh, expanded into neurosis. She's also coming out of her body, which I mean, I do too. So, I mean, and, and it's not even that she has anger in her aura, it, it's that her aura is anger. Notice her face. Even when we took the face, I'm sorry, baby, I'm just kind of nudge my dog. Um, even when we took the picture um, off, you know, the internet, which is public domain, her face is orange and red and angry. She looks like an impaloom. I'm sorry, Lynn, but you do. So um, maybe use different makeup or something. Refer back to the previous picture. Does this look like a happy person? So this is a different picture, but we have the same miserable scowl on this magical healer's face. Now here's her promo pictures, which I find interesting because she kind of was doing the one, going for the one eye thing. And is she not, can she not face us? Can she not look into the camera and, um, you know, meet our gaze? Does she have to be all shifty? And, you know, are we doing sex kitchen and culture programming here? Like, what are we doing? So what she and her telesamic scammers that pimp her out promise are basically the world and then some. She can kill your viruses, she can kill your bacteria, she can kill your fungus, she's trauma release, she's radiation, she's chemical wash. Hardly. Um, implant clean out, DNA cleanse, immune system overall, nanotech clean out. First of all, it, it doesn't even make sense to go for that many things. Well, Lynn, do use your own stuff. Again, active inflammation. Again, the side eye cannot meet your gaze dead on. Um, I guarantee you she's not going to pass this test. I made this slide before I did the test. But I'm happy to go to head to head with her again anytime she wants on any client that we both don't know. Um, you will never see a junk consciousness person. Now I'm kind of living for the day when somebody comes to me and be like, I'm real. Now maybe they think they're real and maybe they're not, or maybe they're low level and think they're high level, or maybe I think they're low level and they're high level. Let's figure it out. Let's work it out. I mean, I'll go on any of your shows. Happy to. That's the difference between them and me. I'm real. Uh, so her results of her technology, this is what she's promising in all the MP3s she's selling. You will get rid of yeast and fungus upgraded to include, does she sound like a carnival barker or what? No, it's upgraded to include Epstein-Barr virus, microscopic mites, vaccine reversal. Whoa. Oh, whoa. I'll probably get this. I should have said that. I'll probably get this like video x -nade because of that. But reversal, really? Let's prove it. Prove it. Sorry, it makes me mad. Tapeworms, tapeworms are big old physical things. How the heck is she going to get tapeworms out with her little piddly frequencies? Where are frequencies coming from? If they're coming from this face, there's nothing coming out of that face. Feel the frequency. It doesn't take a rocket scientist. And it's again, it's fear, 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 selling fear. That's what the telesummits are famous for. That's how they train you. Tell they train the agents. Resolve testing Lynn with my technology, which is just horror frequencies telling me who she is. It's not me guessing. I'm not using my psychic abilities, which I do have, which are real. Now everyone has stuff. I have tons of stuff and my people know my stuff and I'm open about my stuff. And I don't claim that the things that I do takes out all this stuff. She does, that's the difference. No idea what you are doing or talking about and have no track record. She has no training in any of this. Be authentic, be honest, play with you more about frequencies and frequency healing than you do. Now sound healing, toning, tuning forks, no, but that's temporary and she claims it's permanent, it's temporary. It doesn't permanently remove blockages and it doesn't even usually remove blockages. So our tech actually has a lot of lab studies that backs up our stuff, where's yours Lynn? Now it's wrong stuff. So if you had stuff, like I use my own stuff every day, haven't this morning, but I will. Um, and my practitioners use the stuff and my clients use my stuff. Heal yourself, Lynn. What garbage these telehosts, summit hosts and healers are pimping out. So Lynn herself, I'm, 
she resonates with parasites. Remember her, her cure? Why does she resonate with parasites? If she has the magical cure, she resonates with heavy metal toxicity. She has excessive degeneration. And you can tell, again, if you know Chinese medicine, that she has excessive degeneration by looking at her face. She's extremely acidic. You can also tell that by looking at her. Uh, horrible diet and blood sugar issues. She needs to check into that, or maybe she needs to make foods. Uh, she, her kidneys uh, look like she doesn't drink, and also her skin. Again, all the pictures show her hydration is poor, and she resonates with extreme fungus. Why would you ever, in a million years, billion, trillion, why wouldn't she be at least using some of the things? Like, she, and it's garbage and lies. So some spirit soul issues, little missy needs to work on. Well, number one, ego. If you watch her videos, you can just feel the ego. And I'm not saying I wasn't in ego. Um, I was like many years after their body. So this is not somebody you want to go to for psychic advice or ascension advice or raising your frequency or expansion or anything. She cannot travel or get out of her own body. So don't go to her for advice. She's completely stopped trying to be healthy. This is what her own energy field is self. She can make you healthy. Again, Carnival Barker, snake oil salesman, car salesman. Uh, she's suffering. You can read this clearly on her face, but the frequency of suffering is in her field. Her mental structure is firmly entwined with it, 3D. That's why she's on the junk consciousness telesummits. She's clinging to a lot of various illusions within and without lying to self. We all do. But I mean, again, this is how she's pitching herself. She can reach a higher state of being if she desired, but she thinks she is the you know what and has it down our tech reveals all and then some but not everyone else's does because you can buy the same program that's not programmed by me and you're not going to get the same information because most of the people working for my competitors are not do not have the access to knowledge or knowledge or experience that i have it's not ego it's fact um, why? It's all in the programming. We have 25 years of experience with frequencies. Um, yeah. Buyer beware. Stop buying the smooth talk. You can ask us about an iOS. We only have it in iOS. Um, and you can always still get a little uh, tablet or um, iPad, mini iPad. Yeah, it's not that expensive now, so we figure we don't need to do Android or inquire about our small app. Please like and subscribe, send your requests to do other public figures or healers. I was really tempted to keep going with Lynn, to be honest. Come learn with us. We are the best at all things frequency and the most expansive, especially in the woo. Uh, ask us about our new Jumpstart Innovative Program, uh, which I don't want to go into here, but it's a really cool mentorship program that's an extraordinary value. Like and subscribe. Uh, it takes some time to make these videos, and I have to step away from my other work. And answer your request. <laughs> so uh, again, www.secrettoeverything.com. Please like and subscribe this video. Please send me your request or put it in the comments. Please note all comments go through me. So if you're nasty, I don't mind debate. I don't mind disagreement, but I like respectful comments. So that's that. We'll see if this makes it through since I said that naughty word. Well, she says the naughty word too, which she really shouldn't be. And the telesummit shouldn't be saying that either. All right, so secrettoeverything.com. We're going to be updating that, offering some new things. It, we really need an overhaul. We've just been really busy. Uh, look for me on all sorts of, on my um, website, my radio sh um, media tab, all sorts of radio shows, all sorts of um, appearances. So yeah, hope to be interacting with you soon. Take care. Thank you.